Hello everybody, yes, it's with ya, and welcome back to another tutorial on the Twin Plays channel. Today in this video, we're going to be talking about an admin panel uh, for the Steel Brain Rot series. Now, um, this wasn't made by me. Uh, in the last video, we kind of talked about the easy visuals and using uh, radiance and gra uh, gradients and rarities, all that kind of stuff. Um, so we're going to go straight into this just with the admin panel. Uh, we thank you, thank you so much for 100k subs, guys. It's just amazing. I'm so happy. Um... But yeah, I have a lot of stuff coming. Um, now, hopping straight into this, uh, this is probably for V3 of the kit. Now, um, like I said, I will be putting all this stuff in the description. If you do join my Discord, oh gosh, sorry. If you do join my Discord, sorry, I'm a little sick. If you do join this Discord, I have everything in here talking about the full kit and all that kind of stuff. Um, so I will be putting that all in there for you guys, which is awesome. But yeah, this was made by one of the Golden Milks uh, guy. But so this will be in the description. This is it right here. You can hit open in studio. You can hit download, whatever's easier. But just feel free to grab it, okay? So once you grab it, now uh, all you're going to do is uh, you're gonna just import it. Now I haven't actually looked at this specifically, so we're gonna see. Um, so set up important. Move the GUI to okay. So we're gonna put some stuff. Admin panel GUI. We're gonna go into uh starter gui that's good to look at um, i'm going to close all these other things for now so we don't we're not confused sound service in sounds okay ui click and ui error so inside of sounds perfect and then server script service perfect and then in remotes and events so we're going to storage remotes and then events okay perfect so um we can close this out so we don't need to worry about that anymore updates it looks like he has some of the players dropped on glitched okay that's kind of cool well thank you to the person that has made this it looks like it's Krito and drip Krito or something okay all right so let's look at the service of service real quick all right yeah this is definitely in some other thing okay either way let's just look through here so this talks about like some admin stuff invisible spawn thing announcements okie dokie unban and that okay so we're good we don't need to worry about that um yeah, events configuration modules perfect okay now we can go inside the admin panel and ui handler all right so it looks like we have a bunch of stuff in here we have money steals rebirths we have fun commands we have tabs there's colors so it looks like you made it so you can do colors so if you want to change colors you can do that as well that's kind of nice current tab uh setup drop down and we're just gonna look through here okay so you're probably wondering what am i doing uh i'm just first going and making sure that i uh, doesn't have anything that I uh, will miss. I don't know where you set up the uh, admins. It looks like so. Let's double check with Greg or something. Else. No, no, no. There should be something that just talks about where you can see where you can set up. I um, set up <clears throat> move sound effects, move road events. Huh. Okay. So there's no thing that talks about where the visibility. I'm guessing it's just disabled, so that's probably why. Or no, it's definitely enabled. Let me see. All right, so if we click play, maybe it'll load up already. I'm, I'm tripping. Um, definitely not. Okay. Let me see how you want to make it visible. Oh, it's server storage events. Wait for child. Replicate storage dot traits. Uh, server storage for child events. Traits, traits, traits. All right, let me see this real quick. Okay, so, all right, so what you have to do, um, it actually should just work for you already. Um, if you did, if you don't know how to, and I'll show you how, but, so yeah, basically, it's open, okay? Now, there's fun, there's stats, there's mod, there's all this kind of stuff. It's actually pretty nice, um, honestly. Uh, it's pretty cool. There's, like, announcements, so here, okay, nice, hello. Um, server send, so I guess it, like, does a little thing. But yeah, so this is what will pop up for you. Now, only reason it's popping up is because of the way it's at. So, so I guess there's like demon, true, server start. So like it does a demon thing. Um, um, and then now it does the demon uh, trait. So um, looking at this, it has all this right here. Now, you guys are probably wondering, um, if you I've been watching my series, you probably have the V2. So I'm going to need you guys to go and make V3. Um, I could make a video on this, but I'm going to do like a full like rundown of the kit at the end of the series. So if you do have V3 already, this is going to work. Um, this doesn't work with V2. Now, um, I did update my kit to work like so it has this, all this cool stuff or whatever. And 
the floors and all that to work with v3 um i just it's just still that for now but yeah so there's all this cool stuff there's events there's um there's yeah there, there's a bunch of stuff so i can turn it off um another thing like events right here there's traits um there's stats so i can you know do the stat money steals blah blah, blah amount execute there's mod fun and all this other stuff so it's a really good admin panel actually um and i'll be talking about commander probably too later but for now honestly like this works great um and you can customize this however you want so um as you can tell though he had it so it was made right so commands you need to go inside your commands this is located in the configuration in server storage and then commands and just whitelist yourself so that's all you need to do to make it work um now like i said there's customization so if you want to like change colors and stuff you can um another thing to do too if you want to look at the buttons and everything so once we can i can just close this out but once you go into here um you can actually like change this stuff so like you have an open panel button like i could move this around and i can put it anywhere i want so um if i wanted to put it down here by that i can i can make it bigger um it's up to you there is ui aspect ratio constraint so just watch out for that kind of stuff but yeah, and then um, same thing goes for just like the frame in general. Like if you want to make it visible and just kind of look at it and see what the buttons are like, feel free to do that. And you can tell like there's all this fun stuff and it shows you everything. So feel free to customize it and mess around, you guys. Um, this is a great panel. I honestly probably will look into it for um, the Girl Garden series. But yeah, that's about it. You just add it into your game and it should be done. You should be able to... Uh, mess around now um yeah like i said i'll probably explain how to do the events and everything and uh all this later because i know a lot of people are curious about these kind of things so we'll go into that but yeah um i will uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next video let me know if you have any more <coughs> suggestions but i'll catch you guys in a bit bye